Hello, this is Mike Levingham from Natural Current showing our Savior unit in its swing pool with a garden hose connected to our return line out of our pump. Now what this demonstrates is this shows the water flow going through our three 20 micron filter cartridges. It also shows if you wanted to, you can drain your swing pool. And a pool this size will probably take about 16 hours or so to drain, free of charge by the sun. But it also demonstrates the back pressure that we have that if you wanted to use the uh, return line as a water feature during the day sometimes, or to set the return water in your spa, or other water feature, you definitely can. So I'm going to demonstrate the Savior uh, is able to get wet and still work when it gets water on it. So there's water on the Savior, and the garden hose connected to it. And it still runs just fine. So the Savior definitely can get wet, and it doesn't hinder the performance whatsoever. Showing our Savior with the garden hose connected to it, and also demonstrating about, about 12 feet, 10 feet of head right now, with the garden hose up on top of the roof. And I just set it up there and looped it around. But it definitely demonstrates the Savior uh, has a pretty significant return flow and pressure. I could turn it off simply by taking a rag and throwing it on the savior panel, which it stops the electricity from the panel, which activates the pump. So let me go ahead and remove the towel, and we'll get back to work. And there it starts pumping, builds its pressure, and there we go. Come back around the other side here. See it's definitely connected to our return line. And doing pretty good, pretty good head on it. Go ahead and pick it up. Yep, there's the difference. Can't stand listening to that. That's more like it. Well, since I got to here, maybe I'll show you the ocean, huh? Let's go for a walk here and check out the view. I'll have to get something out of it as well, huh? <laughs> Thank you.
every day. It's called Strand Beach, Dana Point. It's called Miguel Shores, the Breaker Isle. Red Carlton is right down there, which is called Salt Creek Beach. And Catalina is right out there. Can't really see it right now. This is what we care about. Keeping the planet just like this.